Hi, this is another product demo uh, from gadgetbaby.co.uk. Uh, this is an item we've just got in. It's the childproof, waterproof iPad case. Um, this fits all the generations of the iPads, uh, which is quite unusual. Uh, most sort of uh, childproof cases, or any iPad cases for that matter, only either fit the, the, the iPad 1 or the iPad 2 and 3, whereas this covers all of them which is quite good especially considering a lot of people have upgraded their iPad ones for the newer iPads um, and reserved their older iPads for the kids um, so this will work on all of them um, as with our iPhone um, case which is uh, the same sort of design from the same manufacturers um, it is great for parents as well not just for the kids uh, this is a great accessory if you like to if you're going on a beach holiday and you'd like to take your iPad as, as a reader or, or as a media viewer just to um, pass the time on the beach um, you don't have to worry about sand getting to your iPad because this is soundproof too and it's also great things if the kids are, are bored on the beach they can they can play with the iPad and you won't worry about any water or sand getting to it right so let's uh, crack it over and have a look So those that are familiar with our iPhone case, um, it'll look, it's a, basically a very similar design. Um, you've got a hard perspex frame uh, which covers you right around the back and the front. Um, and uh, unlike many cases on the market, this has got a clear membrane on the front and the back. Um, and that ensures that your screen won't get scratched, but more importantly that none of the elements uh, or water or juice or anything like that will get to the iPad. Um, now to unclip it, there's these sort of uh, childproof, if you like, clips, which you just got to clip open. There's four of them. Um, and you might notice when you first um, get the case and you first open it, it will take a bit of effort to open, but that's only because the seals, the seals are new. Um, you'll notice there's some uh, accessories inside. Basically what this is, is if you've got the iPad 1 that will fit straight in the case you won't need to do anything but if you've got the iPad uh, 2 or the iPad 3 or the new iPad as it's known um, these are basically spaces you just put in the corner just to reduce movement I mean you could just put the iPad in there but if you don't want it to move around um, you've got to put these in um, it also comes with these pads that if you want to lean the case up against a wall or, or an object this will stop it from slipping um, and so that you can test the unit is properly waterproof before you put your iPad in there and submerge it in water it's recommended that you put this bit of paper in the iPad, submerge it under water um, just to ensure that it, it doesn't get wet and that's that, that's what's in there now first of all I'll demo the product uh, by putting in the iPad 1 uh, now you'll see there is um, a bit of a cutout over there. Basically, that's where the speaker goes. So that just allows the sound to travel. So just place the iPad in. Make sure it's snug between all the spaces that are there. Just clean the screen a bit. Close it. And again, like the iPhone case, this is a clamshell design. Close all your clips. Make sure that they close properly. And there you go. Um, it's fully protected um, all around the edges. Um, it is will stop your screen from getting scratched, uh, and it will stop water, sand, or anything like that getting in there. And it is fully usable, as you can see. Um, it works fine. Touch screen works okay, um, and that's that. Uh, I'll show you now what to do if you've got the newer versions of the iPad. Let's close that. And I'll demonstrate, because it's super clear membrane on the front and back, you, um, it's designed so that you can use your camera um, in the case, the front and back cameras. Now you'll see what I mean, if I just put the, case, the, the iPad straight in here, There's not a huge amount of movement, so you could probably just drop it in, but because it's thinner, it does have a bit of up and down movement, so it is best to use to use the spaces. Let's take this out. 
So these are the spaces it comes with. Just open up the pack. Just pick them off. So you've got these labels here. This is your upper left. And you'll see there's these little grooves that it just plugs into. This is your upper right. It goes in there. Your lower right. All you do, make sure the speaker side goes there. The iPad just literally drops in, and then you clamp the case closed. And you can see there. There's less movement now, so that holds it snugly in place. And once again, the touch screen works fine. Um, and if I launch the camera, I'll turn it sideways. You can see here, you can see out of the camera fine. And you can switch the camera around as well and view front and camera as well. So if you want to do FaceTime in the bath with the grandparents or something like that, you don't have to worry about the kids dropping um, the iPad in the water. Um, and that's it. This is the Aqua iPad case, and as mentioned, we do the same thing uh, for the iPhone as well.